when David Beckham came to Harlem to play soccer with the kids, he chose to do it in front of City Arts Pieces for Peace mosaic wall, created by 1,000 volunteers and sponsored by the Walt Disney Company. City Arts, making a difference through the arts. Since 1968, City Arts has brought people together to produce public art. And that means mosaic, sculpture, and especially murals. It's all about collaborations. People doing something for their community, for their neighborhood. Join us as we share ideas, draw and paint, and ultimately create a lasting legacy. September 11th, it was a turning point for our nation and an opportunity for City Arts to reach out to begin the healing process. It actually was September 12th that Sippy called me and she said there's a real need that we got to do something fast and can Disney uh, sponsor a wall. Without blinking, we said yes. Forever Tall, a tribute to New York and New Yorkers, is one of City Arts' most powerful murals. The Twin Towers, covered in flowers, makes a bold statement that we'll never forget. Celebrating the heroes of our city became a spectacular way to continue the healing. We start from brainstorming ideas with the artists, with the kids themselves, thinking about what issue they would like to address. Kids of all ages have the opportunity to look at themselves and their community in a different light. The creative process is as important as the end result. They are drawing and thinking and creating poems or uh, writing about their lives and the futures they would like to create for themselves. The artist then creates the maquette model from which the group is actually painting the wall. We're not working on art for art's sake only. We are working on art as a meaningful tool to create better neighborhoods. The time that we took, instead of wasting, or instead of um, going outside or selling drugs in the corner and stuff, we took our time so we could put up the mural. And when you hear a kid says that, you say to yourself, you actually made it. Because if we could get one kid off the street and guide him to an alternative, which is a creative alternative that will help him build a better life, we already made a big success. When we're older, we can come back and we can remember that we did that. Kids from all different cultures and backgrounds are collaborating on expressing what they are. They are celebrating their differences and they are creating a mural, a sculpture, a mosaic again, right in their neighborhood. I feel proud and happy because you still walk past here and just look at a bunch of dirt and everything. And now we paint the sun and people walk by and they be surprised and stuff and happy that they could look in here and look at something nice. This is it. Okay. Now we're on scaffolding. City arts keep up the good work. Keep up the good work. We talk to our kids and we tell them that it's not enough to have a great idea and it's not enough to care. You need to dare to make the difference. The funny thing that I think has happened here, I think the kids were attracted to this project first. By thinking globally but acting locally, City Arts projects like the Pieces for Peace Mosaic offer something truly unique. People from so many different places and we can get along. We have a beautiful ribbon cutting ceremony where everyone comes together to celebrate the finished product. We would love to paint 200 more in the park, I hope. I want to think I did that. I did some of it.